5 Reasons Why You Absolutely Need To Visit Rwanda Hello this lovers, welcome back to another exciting video presented to you by this floor and thanks for watching. In this video we shall be presenting to you 5 reasons why you absolutely need to visit the historic country of Rwanda before you die. But first, let's have a brief background of Rwanda. Rwanda is a landlocked country in the Great Rift Valley where the African Great Lakes region and East Africa converge. One of the smallest countries on the African mainland, its capital city is Kigali. Located a few degrees south of the equator, Rwanda is bordered by Uganda, Tanzania, Burundi, and the Democratic Republic of Congo. It is highly elevated with its geography dominated by mountains in the west and savannah to the east, with numerous lakes throughout the country. The climate is temperate to subtropical, with two rainy seasons and two dry seasons each year. Rwanda has a population of over 12.6 million, living on 26,338 km square of land and is the most densely populated mainland African country. The population is young and predominantly rural, with a density among the highest in Africa. Christianity is the largest religion in the country. The principal language is Kinyarwanda, spoken by most Rwandans, with English and French serving as additional official languages. The president is Paul Kagame of the Rwandan Patriotic Front, who has served continuously since 2000. Today, Rwanda has low levels of corruption compared with neighboring countries. Rwanda is one of the only three countries in the world with a female majority in the national parliament, the two other countries being Bolivia and Cuba. Rwanda's developing economy suffered heavily in the wake of the 1994 genocide, but has since strengthened. Coffee and tea are the major cash crops for export. Tourism is a fast-growing sector and is now the country's leading foreign exchange earner. Rwanda is one of the only two countries in which mountain gorillas can be visited safely and visitors pay high prices for gorilla tracking permits. Music and dance are an integral part of Rwandan culture, particularly drums and the highly choreographed indoor dance. Traditional arts and crafts are practiced throughout the country, including imigongo, a unique cow dung art. If you are new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. So far, we are sure Rwanda is already in your bucket list of countries you want to visit. But here are 5 reasons why you should check that box and absolutely visit Rwanda. Number 1. Rwanda is clean, safe and friendly. The 1994 war and genocide in Rwanda is now well and truly in the past and the country is the safest in East Africa with low crime rates. In 2016, the Gallup's Law and Order Index for Rwanda was 84, which is as much as Australia's. Chances are you will feel safer walking down the street at night in Kigali than you will ever anywhere else in the world. And did we mention how clean it is? Kigali is rated one of the cleanest cities in the world, as the streets of the capital are spotless. One day every month, Rwandans take part in Umuganda, a day when all of the shops are closed and everyone performs community service, whether that be fixing the neighbor's fence, digging a ditch, picking up rubbish or fixing the road. The current president Paul Kagame formalized Umuganda as a collective event happening on the last Saturday each month and he also sometimes participates. On this day, the traffic stops for a few hours in the morning and all Rwandans aged between 18 to 65 are required to participate in communal projects. Rwandans are so friendly that anything you need whether directions, help or even food, just ask and they are more than willing to help you out. More often than not, the person you ask will take time out of their day to walk you to your destination to make sure you get where you're going. Be prepared. The beauty of the country will take your breath away. Number 2. The Amazing Landscapes and Natural Beauty You will get to see a collection of endless views of landscapes while you visit Rwanda. You can experience this while on a road trip to one of the nearby provinces or to any destination. The green countryside are filled with terraced hillsides and farms. Agriculture is a huge economic activity, and that's why coffee and tea are one of Rwanda's largest exports. This is undoubtedly a place for anyone looking to have a peace of mind while on their safari. Rwanda is mountainous, diverse, and just all around gorgeous. Jungles, savannas, volcanoes, lakes, and forests are just a few hours apart, and this little country packs in the beauty. Rwanda is called the land of a thousand hills for a reason, and in between activities, don't forget to take in all the breathtaking views and sunsets. Number 3. The food and coffee are a once-in-a-lifetime experience. 
You must experience Rwandan cuisine to appreciate or even comprehend its amazing flavors. It is even point approved by award-winning American chef Sylvia Bianco. The dishes available in restaurants and luxury hotels like the Kigali Serena Hotel are a blend of traditional Rwandan foodstuffs, such as sambaza or small fish, or raga, a fermented banana beer with modern culinary methods and artistic presentation. The Rwandan brochette or grilled meat or fish on a stick which is eaten with potatoes or plantains is also something of delight. You can also hit the classic Rwandan lunch buffet counter to do as you please while combining various meals. Don't you leave the country without trying Rwandan coffee, as its flavor and taste is simply out of this world. Additionally, the past few years have seen a massive uptake in the Kigali restaurant scene, and the city now offers high-quality sushi, excellent bibimbap, cheesy pizzas, and homemade ice cream. Hence, if you want local Rwandan dishes or international meals and snacks, Rwanda's kitchens have got you covered. Number 4. The mountain gorillas and wildlife in Rwanda is amazing. In popular perception, the key reason to visit Rwanda is its mountain gorilla population, and that's no lie at all. These glorious creatures hunt Volcanoes National Park in the far northwest of the country, where it drops against Virunga National Park in the Democratic Republic of Congo and Ngahinga Gorilla National Park in Uganda, to create one colossal cross-border expanse of wildlife and wonder. Access is of course carefully controlled, but as of 2015, 10 gorilla groups can be glimpsed by tourists, with 80 passes available per day. Rwanda is rarely considered a classic safari destination, but for those seeking things that roar and growl in the night, Akagero National Park is home to a full quarter of the Big Five, that is lion, reno, elephant, buffalo and leopard. Spreading out on the east flank of the country, shaped by the border with Tanzania and the river Kagera, this verdant enclave of savanna and wetlands suffered during Rwanda's turbulent 90s, when poaching and subsistence hunting robbed it of most of its inhabitants. But it has gathered itself considerably since 2009, when it was taken under the wing of rescue and rehabilitation group African Parks. Seven South African lions were introduced in 2015, and 20 black winos were also brought in. These are still faltering baby steps, but Akagera is walking the road to recovery. The Volcanoes National Park is also home to some 300 mountain gorillas. Going gorilla trekking is for many the number one reason to visit Rwanda. This is why since 2000, the government has been working hard to raise awareness and protect mountain gorillas, and it's paying off. Since 2010, the population of mountain gorillas has risen by 26%. Number 5. The Fantastic Weather Rwanda's weather is forever moderate, not so hot and not so cold. Rwanda easily has some of the best weather, compared with its surrounding East African neighbors. Rwanda has a temperate tropical highland climate, with lower temperatures that are typical for equatorial countries because of its high elevation. Kigali in the center of the country where typically daily temperature ranges between 12 and 27 degrees centigrade, with little variation through the year. There are some temperature variations across the country. The mountainous west and north are generally cooler than the lower lying east. There were two rainy seasons in the year, the first runs from February to June and the second from September to December. These are separated by two dry seasons, the major one from June to September, during which there is often no rain at all, and a shorter and less severe one from December to February. Rainfall varies geographically, with the west and northwest of the country receiving more precipitation annually than the east and southeast. The lush green views and all the flowers found throughout the year makes it a joy to move around the country. Dear the explorers, as a little compensation for watching up to this point, here is an extra reason. Number 6. Rwanda has a rich culture. The Tutsi, Hutu and Twa tribes that once clashed now look to a future together, under one common motto, no more division, we forgive. Rwandans are warm and welcoming and share a common love for their homeland. They will probably introduce you to their culture and customs like Umuganda and Kwita Izina that make this country truly unique. The dances, the people with many cultures and traditions will wow you away with their beauty. Ibiwako Cultural Village is the best place to see the displays of Rwanda's finest traditional dances and culture. The men wearing long weaves made from some uncommon material then jumping high up into the sky with a certain formula will keep you hooked and smiling from ear to ear. 
The women are made to move in slow motion dance, but it's perfection by the beating of the drums. There's a lot about Wanda's culture that would excite most visitors. There you have it, the explorers. Those were the five reasons why you absolutely need to visit Rwanda. Thanks for watching this video. If you want us to cover any of your absolute five reasons to visit a particular country, leave a suggestion in the comment section and we will do well to grant your request. Also, if you did enjoy the video, do well to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends.